Hello and welcome to the murder of Sonic the Hedgehog. Yes, this is our video for Happy April Fool's Day. I'm very excited to play it because I think it's going to be fun. And I like Sonic and I like murder mysteries. So it's just going to be silly and fun. That's my expectation. But maybe it'll be serious, serious. We'll never know. Yes, we will. We will know as soon as I start playing. New game. I'm surprised they put this... M it's a visual novel? I'm surprised they put this... I did like zero research on this game. I googled or I was on Twitter and they were like, we made a new game. And I'm like, that's all I need to know. I don't care if it's fake. I'm downloading it right now. I saw the cover image and I was like, yeah. Wait, it's not playing. Here we go. I might need to move. I guess this is our character. This is OC. Oh, made it on tr made it on the train 15 minutes ahead of schedule. Then why are you out of breath? So far so good for my first day on the job. I don't like being on this side. I guess I'm gonna have to be on this side. I don't wanna be on this side. Oh, I totally forgot my name tag isn't ready yet. I should make one. Do we just work on this train? I'll just sign my name here. Is Tiruf. That's my name. Tiruf. Did I spell that right? Did you spell your own name right? Yes. Yes. Hope passengers can read my scribble. Bro, you don't even know about scribbly handwriting. My handwriting is so ass cheeks. Dining car. Uh-oh. Am I nervous? Is this first day on the job jitters? Hope it, working the train's dining car... Working the train's dining car can't be so bad. Come on, Tira. Shake it off. Shake it off. We're not nervous. We're gonna be the best dining car workers ever. Slap! Oh no, the conductor smacked... No, no. I smacked myself. Okay, good. Tiruf, did I just see you hitting yourself? M -m 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 Mr. Conductor, sir, how are you doing this morning? No, I didn't hit myself, don't worry about it. That was just the first day job jitters. <laughs> Quite all right myself, though feeling a little bittersweet. Are these gonna matter? Is that because you're a sweet? Trying to butter me up on the first day, are we? Alas, today's my last day as conductor. I'm retiring after 32 wonderful years. I thought he was gonna say after like, like 2.30, but he said 32. And I was confused. I was like, 32 is not a time you can have. Time for me and the Mirage Express to say goodbye to one another. Oh, congratulations on retirement, sir. Thank you. My wife was very excited about it. She's already got our plane tickets to Spagonia locked. Our shower's been on the fritz, so I'm excited to use the hotels. <laughs> I can see why his wife's excited. Enough of my quibbles. Today's your first day working the dining hall. Here's the menu for today. Menu added to my inventory. <gasps> There's gameplay? I thought it was... Actually, I don't know what I thought. I guess upon playing it, I thought it was just going to be a visual novel. I can open the inventory anytime to view items I've received. I should look over the menu carefully. Mirage Express Dining Menu. It features chili dog, instant ramen, and chicken cordon bleu. What is this ragtag group of food items? What? None of these, none of these should be together. I'm glad that I zoomed in. It really added to the immersion. Why do you look so nervous? All we have on this train is a microwave. 
Then how are we making chicken cordon bleu? Actually, I don't know what chicken cordon bleu is. Maybe it's something not... Maybe you can make it in the microwave. I don't know. <laughs> I, like the, I like the conductor's design. He's a cute little puppy. Well, I'm sure a little quiz is in order. Which of these do we serve in the dining car? Chicken cordon bleu. Ding, ding, ding. Glad you can read the menu, okay? <laughs> a little about the vessel. This is a state-of-the-art high-speed smart train with all the latest gadgets, except an oven. This train can really handle anything you throw at it, unless you want to cook anything that cannot be cooked in a microwave. We've had a lot of adventures together, me and this train. It's not easy to leave. After 32 years, I don't blame him for being wistful. This train is exclusively used for events. It's not a passenger train. I remember that from the interview. What's the event today? A murder mystery party. Nothing better than some thrills to end my tenure as conductor. Guess we'll be funneled here to the dining car as a home base, so to speak. I'll be with you to gather tickets, but after that you'll be on your own. So I'll need you to do everything in your power to make sure our paying guests are well taken care of. Understood? I can't afford to lose this job! I'll make you proud, sir. I will make you proud, sir. <laughs> Glad this old man can rest easy. Doors to the Mirage Express are open all aboard. Oh, I thought he was talking to me. <gasps> I like this train. Oh, I have to click on it. Door. <gasps> There's Amy and Knuckles. And Sonic, maybe. Knuckles has a little hat on. Oh, Amy, she has a birthday hat. What beautiful Amy. Wow, this trade is incredible. What fascinating tech. Oh no. I'm gonna butcher all their voices. Of oh no. You're right, Tails. I can get used to staying on a train like this. What did you all expect? You know I always go all out on my birthday party. This train's as elegant as you are, Amy. Can't promise I won't take anything, though. <laughs> She's already like, I'm gonna steal everything, okay? I love your birthday party, but your presents are mine. Calm down there, Rouge. Did I just... Did I not just catch you stealing from the train station gift shop? It was a pin, knucklehead. Who's gonna miss a teeny tiny pin? What cast of characters am I stuck with? Get a hold of yourself, Tariff. You're sweating through your uniform. Hey, pal. Can I get one of those chili dogs? Uh, of course. Right-o, right -o, friend. right -o. Well, aren't you friendly? Why can't I be normal for one second? Sonic? Wait until I announce everyone's roles to get the f to get food. <laughs> Sorry about that, birthday girl. I'll be coming around to collect everyone's tickets. Please have them out and ready. You'll join me, Tariff, won't you? Just click on whoever you'd like to talk with, and we'll collect their ticket. Don't make me choose. Because I know who I'm going to choose. <laughs> uh, okay, got it. Oh! <gasps> Oh, there's... Blaze is here? Is Silver here? Wait. What the heck is this thing? I'm blocking Rouge! Fuck! Go back. Look at how beautiful she is. Moeth! Okay. I'm sorry, Rouge. I'm gonna have to cosplay as you for a second with your big ears. Welcome to the uh, Mirage Express. Happy birthday, Amy. Weather. I like happy birthday, Amy. Is there anything else I can click on that isn't a person? Mmm, yummy. Don't mind if I do. Tariff, those are for our guests, you know. Train, be sure Tariff only gets one of those if they ask. 
Wow, let me have food. I'm working. I'm hungry. It's capitalist bullshit. Did the arm just kind of nod? Actually, uh, train, the conductor wants me to have the whole plate. <laughs> Good try, young buck. The train and I have worked together a long time. You'll have to work harder than that to get to get to to get what you want. Drat! Those snacks look sn those snacks those snacks look really tasty too. Okay, I have to talk to Rouge first. I'm not no. Yes. Well, hello, you two. What can I do for you? Good morning, ma'am. Can we get your ticket? Oh my, my, how forward. Let me fetch it for you. Thanks. Come back if you need anything else, you hear? Wow, she's so polite. Very easy to talk to as well. I love her. Ma'am, I saw you sneak that $20 bill out of my pocket. Gonna have to kindly ask for that back. I, I didn't do anything. Oh, uh, this was yours? Must have slipped out. Here you go. I may not actually be the best at judging character. No, I'm sure she's easy to talk to. Otherwise, how would she steal from you with such grace and ease? Howdy! Could I please get your ticket? It's all crumpled. I think that's a ticket? But I really don't want to argue with this guy. Why? He's nice. Everything looks good, thank you. Seems the conductor doesn't want to argue either. <laughs> it's me, Knuckles. I'm a cool guy. Um, we'll talk to Amy. Could I please get the birthday girl's ticket? <laughs> Why, certainly. Thank you, miss. And thank you for choosing our fine train for your birthday festivities. Well, my birthday discount certainly helped. Who doesn't love a good bargain? And a murder mystery train just sounds so exciting. It's right up my alley. Who doesn't love a good thrill? And who doesn't love a good murder? <laughs> you see, I'm a girl who loves a good true crime pro podcast. Maybe we should leave her to her fun. That's not a weird thing. Bitches love true crime, true crime podcasts. Before we move along, for you, miss. It's the train present extravaganza. Oh, how fun! Thank you. Where do I use this? That unlocks any door in the train. Happy birthday. The birthday girl gets the birthday key. It's practically tradition. Very useful. We'll use this wisely. Thank you. I feel so bad. I am butchering these characters' voices, but I'm trying. Oh no. Here. Thank you. Everything is in order. He seems concerned about something. That that's just that's just Shadow. Is there anything we can help you with? Do you sell gift bags here? Uh, oh, uh, no, sadly. But we do have a plastic grocery bag in the back I could get for you. He ain't about it. He hated that. He's like, don't you fucking... How dare you even suggest such a thing? That stare. <laughs> so cold. Tears, you're shivering. Do you need me to fetch your jacket? Yes. Ha, no, no, I'm good. Can I talk to them again? Please excuse me, darling. Just need to freshen up before the party begins. Oh. But you already look great. <laughs> Don't I know it? Oh, I think... Oh. She's winking at me, but it, it looks scary. Can I do it again? Oh. Oh, this all looks delectable, but sadly, we'll have to pass. If you get hungry later, we'll have the microwave warmed up for you. <laughs> Maybe we shouldn't tell the customers that. 
Maybe. But I have your ticket. Thank you very much. On top of it, I see. A princess such as myself must always be punctual. P princess? Did she say princess? If you don't mind me asking, are you visiting from somewhere? A separate dimension, actually. A separate what? Just here for Amy's birthday. Then I'll hop back to my own dimension. I quite prefer the birthday cake from this world more than my own. So I admit I'm a bit excited. <laughs> you don't say. Well, I hope you enjoy your stay, princess. Sh should I bow? Do I bow before a princess? Yes. What are you doing? Please get up. Why can I not win with this group? Because they're a bunch of quirky characters. Okay. We're gonna talk to Tails. Could I get your ticket, youngin? Right here, sir. Thank you. Thank you. May I offer you any of the snacks we have on board? No thank no thank you. Oh my god. I I am I feel like I feel so bad. No thank you. When I travel I actually pack my old sparkle I actually pack my old sparkle gelatin. It's a sparkly jelly that can melt any jaded heart. No way. I brought my own sparkle gelatin with me too. It's my first day and I was a little nervous. Don't be nervous. You're doing great so far. We're sparkle gelatin buddies. I cannot think of a happier thing to be than sparkle gelatin buddies with tails. I can't think of anything I want to do more or be more. <laughs> Absolutely. If you need anything, just let us know. Thank goodness. Someone on this train is normal. I don't know if carrying around gelatin in your pocket is normal, but sure. Uh, let's talk to Espio. Is that... That's his name. Oh my gosh, look, he's dressed all crazy. Can we have a ticket? Of course. Excellent. Thank you, and I hope you enjoy your stay with us. Absolutely. I appreciate it. There's a calmness about him. Something about his presence puts me at ease. You consider me calming? <gasps> he's looking right at me! I study the blade, okay? Of course I'm calming. I'm a fucking weeb. I study ninjutsu. I believe one can communicate through the subconscious. W wow. Ninjutsu? That sounds like a lot of difficult training. Can you cling on the walls? Cling on the walls? What kind of question is that? I most certainly can. The conductor looks a bit too smug at that answer. Oh, whoops. This is gonna be hard. Hello, my friend. Can I get your ticket? Uh, sure. Uh, yeah, sure, of course. As a gentleman of upstanding morals, I'd love to show you my ticket. He seems to be avoiding eye contact. Is something amiss, sir? Uh... I seem to have, uh, misplaced my ticket. Could you speak up a bit? I couldn't hear. I misplaced my ticket. I don't know where it is. He's not hiding his embarrassment very well. He's a himbo. Leave him alone. Don't you worry. We'll take a look around to see if it turns up. Oh, that would be amazing. Thanks a million. Seems as though we should keep our eyes peeled for his ticket. I'm gonna do some other talking. You do not need to bow every time you see me. Oh, oh, sorry. No more bowing. Got it. Wonderful. Okay, I need your order now. I'm saving myself for cake. Thank you, though. Are you sure our instant moment doesn't disappoint? I'm quite sure. I'm gonna wait to talk to Sonic so that I can talk to everybody. I'm a. <gasps> I haven't talked to Knuckles! <gasps> Hello, Knuckles. 
Wait, I have talked to Knuckles. M maybe we should leave this dude alone. No, we need to love him. Actually, never mind. <laughs> no, I need to get his order. Not interested. Either he's really not interested or he doesn't know how to read. Wow! Oh, he knows how- I was gonna say, our character is so rude, he knows how to read! I think that was just a reference to Sonic Boom, though. The chicken cordon blue doesn't sound- does sound good, though. Well, that answers that. What a soon. What else do you need? Nothing, just saying hello. Maybe I should, uh, move on. Only three items on this menu? Sorry, sir. Is it every not everything to your liking? I just expected a bit more from a train so state-of-the-art. You don't even have drinks listed? He's not wrong. I'm s but I'm still offended somehow? We offer Wadi? 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 We offer water, coffee, and Chaos Cola as well, sir. I'll have to take you up on the coffee soon. Just the beans on a spoon, though. I can't get a read on this guy. He just wants to eat coffee beans on a spoon. He's a freak. Uh, she didn't want anything. She didn't want anything. She didn't want anything. He wants coffee beans on a spoon. He wants cordon bleu, maybe. He hasn't found his ticket. What do you want, Tails? What a beautiful trade. I feel completely at ease. Agreed. Great. I don't like reading things from strangers. Ooh, ooh. Fair enough. Reading? You don't like reading things from strangers? That's what he said. Find anything yet? Um, we're still looking. Keep me posted, kid. I notice I can go over here, but I gotta take everyone's order. This train is exquisite. I'm enjoying my time already. Me too. Glad to hear it. Am SBO's got got some kind of some kind of something, some kind of aura about him. I don't remember him being so charismatic. I would order one of each, but I'm here for the party. I'll eat when everyone else does. What excellent principles! Plus, I had a snack right before this. Oh. I think I've talked to everyone except for Sonic. <gasps> I found the ticket. Okay, I guess I'll get the ticket. What's sticking out of the napkin holder? Say, wasn't someone looking for their ticket earlier? Let's be sure to return this to its rightful owner. And let's make no make, make sure no one uses their ticket as a napkin. Lost ticket is added to your inventory. Alright, we're gonna talk to the blue man himself. Ticket, please. Thank you kindly. Happy to have someone as renowned as yourself aboard. Oh, Sonic is famous in this world? <laughs> what? Don't worry about it. I just like helping. When Eggman took over, I truly feared the worst. But my kids swore you would swoop in eventually, and you did. I can't offer much other than my sincere gratitude. Don't sweat a thing. I'm glad you and your family are safe. Wait a second. Is he... Is he Sonic the Hedgehog? I promise you an excellent stay on our trade, Sonic. Have fun. Y yes have fun now. We'll do, thanks. Do you want a chili dog? Shoot, I was supposed to get Amy a cake. What am I gonna do? Uh, good luck with that. I'll figure something out. Oh my god, I'm gonna lose my mind. This game is so fucking cute already. I can't, they're fucking, they're out here blushing and being cute. And being embarrassed and shit, ugh. 
It's messed up. I'll be back for that chew dog. For a hero such as yourself, it'll be on the house. I thought everything was on the house. I thought that all the food was, like, paid for for the event or whatever. I appreciate that. I kind of forgot my wallet at home. Then how was he going to buy the chili dog earlier? He wasn't. That's the kicker. All right, let's give him back his ticket. Find anything yet? Well, we just might have what you need. Here, why don't you show our friend here what we picked up? So sad to see a ticket alone and confused like this. We'll return it. I have faith. This one. Ah, oh, there it is. That's my ticket. Thanks so much to you both. I was really worried you'd kick me out and I'd miss the murder mystery. Oh, Tira here wouldn't have their hands full kicking you out. You're right. I wouldn't leave without a fight. I would kill you. <laughs> Wait, who made me both expert? My, who made me both microwave expert and security guard? Honestly, if you're not already a microwave expert, that sounds like a, a skill issue. You're both all right in my book. Thanks again for the assist. Of course. Just let us know if you need anything else. Okay, everyone. Time for me to read out everyone's goals for the murder mystery. And much like you to leave, I must prepare the driver's compartment for departure. Ah, the conductor's car. You remember our promise, yeah? You'll do everything in your power to make sure our guests have a safe and enjoyable time on the Mirage Express. Absolutely. You can count on me. To be honest, this group it seems pretty capable on their own. And train. Assist Turf if they need any help, won't you? Beep, beep. <laughs> That's all I need to hear. You have my trust. Nothing more heartwarming than a conductor in his train. Dot, 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 dot. Excellent. I'll be off. I must take my leave, everyone. Please have a phenomenal time. And don't worry about mucking up the place either. This train is state-of-the-art and has systems for detailing with all that. Dealing with all that, I just added a whole bunch of letters. For everything else, please talk to Tiriff here if you need anything. South sounds good. Absolutely. Will do. Goodbye now. I like that guy. Thank you all for following the outfit guide I sent you. You all look amazing. I trust you all read your lore cards as well. Lore cards? That must be the details of their motivations. I suppose it makes sense lore cards aren't read out loud. Otherwise, people would know the murderer's intentions. Now... On to the nitty gritty. For the murder mystery game, one of you will be murdered, and the rest suspects. Everyone has assigned roles for characters they will be playing. Participation is required, for it is my birthday. Of course. Birthday girl makes the rules. Sonic, you are a ship captain, and you're to be, and you'll to be, you'll be stationed in the conductor car. Naturally, that's where the captain would go. Tails, you are the detective. You'll be here in the dining call car. Indubitably. Knuckles, you're the sheriff. Around you're the sheriff around these parts. We'll find you in the saloon. Got it. Rouge, you're a business tycoon. And Blaze, you're a titan of industry, both in the casino. What's the difference? There is none. <laughs> hmm, sounds fun. Vector, you're the butcher, and SBL the poet, both found in the library. Why is the butcher in the library? Hear that, SBO? We'll get to hang out together. And do what? Read? Maybe we can make a tower of books or something. Shadow is the locksmith. Hanging out in the lounge. Hmm. And last but not least, me, the journalist reporter. I'll be mose moseying around with everyone. Did you get all that? What if I say no? Are they just going to repeat it? Yes. Uh, I was listening in. Hope that's okay. 
more than all right. You can help ensure everyone's following their roles. Oh, that reminds me. Oh, I have a map. Sick. Why does this map look like this? I guess so they could fit it on the page better. I have a map for each of you. Everyone's station is marked on this map as well. How convenient. Map added to your inventory. The rules of the game are as follows. There is a murder amongst you all. Um, among us? The murderer can kill a single participant however they choose, but they must physically be present with the victim for it to count. Everyone else must collect evidence throughout the train and use it to interrogate fellow passengers to figure out who done it. The murderer will lie to get out of being accused, so inspect everything you can. Find clues and interrogate. I'll set a timer for one hour so everyone can mingle and the murderer, the murderer can do their thing. Is everyone ready? Sounds like everyone's excited. Everyone to your stations. So I think I am going to leave this video off here. And I don't know how long this game is. So I'm going to kind of do it in like, like half hour spurts. And if it just turns out being short, super short, I'll just put them all together in like a longer video. Well, that is the introduction of the, the murder of Sonic the Hedgehog. I have a feeling that Sonic is going to get murdered. So I will see you all for the demise of Sonic, something Eggman could never do, in the next video. Ah. <sighs>